Settings and Actions, a rather important and rather well hidden menu is sitting here to the right of your user ID. A little drop down displays settings and actions. In here we have a number of rather useful links. The first one to take note is you've got the downloads. So when you access your cloud environment, be sure to download EPM Automate. Make sure you download SmartView and also the other extensions, which will give you extra functionality in SmartView. This SmartView add-on for administrator is referred to as the planning extension, will allow you to administer metadata in SmartView. And this extension down here will give you functionality or extra functionality, allowing you to work in Excel when working with the close manager and also supplemental data forms. So explore the downloads and certainly download the items in there to get the full FCCS toolkit. You've got help and there is detailed help and I regularly use the help to look at the updates to the admin guides. Most useful place is to click on books and here you've got a list of all these different types of guides. So again you'll have access to this when you use these links within your environment. So do make uh, good use of those links and ensure that you download various guides that you need access to. You've also got Cloud Customer Connect. We recommend you join the Cloud Customer Connect. It's similar to the older Oracle Technical Network, but this is where the uh, all the communications, the blogs, questions and answers can be made uh, on this one site and we'll show you this later on. You can provide feedback to Oracle and you've got a link to Oracle support. You've also got about which is all about this particular version uh, and you can obviously use this version and look at the version and obviously more about this particular release. So do get comfortable with your settings and actions menu. You'll also use this option, Reload Navigation Flows, when you start to customise the cards and the clusters using what are called navigation flows. This, this will reload a new navigation flow, which could potentially change the layout and the customised way that you've set up your cards and clusters.